New at 10, former President Donald Trump says he will no longer testify in his defense at his civil fraud trial this week. This is days after a legal spokesperson vowed that the former president doesn't cower. ABC's Allison Kosick is in with details. Donald Trump had been scheduled to testify in his own defense at his civil fraud trial on Monday. He will open himself up to whatever they want because he's not afraid. People that are afraid cower. President Trump doesn't cower. But on Sunday, Trump abruptly canceled his plans to testify, making the announcement on his social media platform, Truth Social. The former president citing the testimony of his expert witness, the use of his ironclad disclaimer clause, and alleged bias by the judge overseeing the case as reasons he no longer plans to testify. Trump, his sons Eric and Don Jr., along with other Trump Organization executives, have been accused of engaging in a decades-long scheme using fraud and misrepresentation to inflate Trump's net worth to receive more favorable loan terms. The former president has denied any wrongdoing. This is a case that should have never been brought. This is a witch hunt. This is election interference at a level that has never seen before. New York Attorney General Letitia James responding to the change in plans in a statement saying, we have already proven that he committed years of financial fraud and unjustly enriched himself and his family, adding Trump cannot distract from reality in the trial. The trial now set to resume on Tuesday with the cross-examination of defense accounting expert Eli Bartov. Once his testimony concludes, it's expected the defense will rest. The attorney general's office plans to present a brief rebuttal case, which could finish the same day. Closing arguments are scheduled for January 11th, and a written decision in the case could come from the judge in late January. Allison Kosick, ABC News, New York.